Trust. Trico, seeing you through. Welcome back, everyone. I'm Beth Haynes. This year, some Halloween costumes are going high tech, even coming alive. We're talking about frantically moving eyeballs, crazy clown eyes, even beating zombie hearts. And if you want something less scary, there's the adorable kitten eyes. The animated costumes are the work of a NASA engineer. Pretty impressive. Dan Thompson from Clearest Networks joins us now to show us how it all works, how it all comes together. Very unique this Halloween yes. season. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, apparently this is what NASA engineers do when they're bored. Uh, is Wish think I of, had that capability, I right? Know, I know. So, uh, you know, wildly creative. Basically what they've done is they've taken a, a, a phone, which I have my phone here, and I'll, I'll show it to you and then show it to the camera. But essentially all it is, is, uh, are just a couple of circles and some eyeballs, animated eyeballs that they've made there. Uh, and then you slide this into like a little pocket in the t-shirt. Uh -huh. uh, and then so in this this particular example is the cute little cat that they were showing. So uh, they've got everything from, you know, scary looking clowns to zombies. And then uh, like you mentioned, if you want to get really gory, uh, they have like a beating heart uh, that you can have under your shirt as well. So uh, just kind of just random last minute. I don't have anything to wear to this coffee costume party that I'm going to, so I'll throw on this animated t-shirt. <laughs> Pretty wild. We just saw it on the, the back of someone's car, too. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, and that's the thing is the app is free, so feel free to get as creative as you want to. If you've got iPads, you can do it as well, but now it's much bigger. I think they were showing uh, somebody putting that over the windows in their door a minute yeah. ago at the beginning, so just crazy cool idea. That didn't um, cost anything. I know, I know. Yeah, so the app is totally free. Um, the t-shirts, which, by the way, you can get at Party City as well. I haven't mm -hmm. checked the local stores to see if they have them, but uh, Digital Duds is the website that you get these things from. They also list that Party City sells them as well. So they actually have the pocket yep. that you slide your phone in. That's right. That's right. So it's a t-shirt with some kind of animated um, or, or some kind of picture on the front of it, and it comes with a pocket. The phone just kind of slides in the pocket, so it would be something like this, and then the um, you know then the eyeballs would look around as you're, <laughs> as you're wearing the shirt. <laughs> and producer Lisa was just telling us that the, the NASA engineer that designed this also has something up his sleeve for Christmas. Yeah. Uh, something to, um, I guess, accessorize those. Yeah, here Christmas we go. Yeah, sweaters, with the, the ugly, ugly t-shirts. <laughs> so you might add a little bling to that if you're going to an ugly sweater Christmas party. Well, let's talk more about technology and how it's changing up Halloween. Yeah. So I mean, this is just a great example. I mean, I've seen, you know, if you look at the even the yard things that people have mm -hmm. out today, right? I mean, like a couple of years ago, it was just like a blow-up doll, but Not now anymore. it's like if you go to Home Depot, it's got cats that have heads that move and I mean it just I guess I guess people are fanatical about Halloween and so this is just another outlet for them to say hey let's use technology in, in neat and interesting ways. Well and technology has become such a part of our lives I that's guess right. it makes sense. Yeah that's absolutely right and if you look at I mean uh, Halloween obviously has a, not to use a weird word here but kind of a bit of a cult following so mm -hmm. to speak uh, and I mean people just get super excited about adults feel like kids again because it reminds them of going trick-or-treating when you're kids and so you know naturally guys like this are thinking of interesting things to do with technology and maybe new ways to scare people. Well, you're a tech guru. What are you doing at your house? Any I'm actually, any? I, you know, I'm just not a Halloween guy. I don't know yeah. why, but I, I just never gotten into dressing up. So I guess my wife calls me a stick in the mud when it comes to Halloween. I so. thought you'd have some fancy, I don't know, high tech you are. Now, I've got a good buddy that just goes over the top with it. So I'll go look at, he's got like the smoke cannon and all kinds of crazy yeah. stuff. So uh, I go and look at his and, and get a good kick out of his stuff. All right. Well, if you're looking for that last minute Halloween costume and this is interesting to you and you'd like to sport the eyeballs. What's the, the name of the app again? Uh, so Digital Duds is the Digital app. Duds. That's where okay. you can get the just the eyeballs and things like that for your phone. <laughs> you can also buy the, the shirts from them and at Party City. Okay. Uh, the shirts are $30. Perfect. Yeah. So now you have your Halloween costume. No worries. <laughs> we know what you're dressing up as. No stick in the mud over here. That's right. That's right. <laughs> All right, Dan. Always good to see you. Thanks so much for coming no on. No problem. And coming up, a North Dakota woman won't be giving all trick or Trier's candy this year. Some will get this letter or controversial message to parents coming up next. And one town is laying down the law on Halloween.